Well, good morning. We are glad that you are, are here with us again this morning uh, as we uh, worship our Lord Jesus Christ. Um, this morning we're going to do another interview, this time with one of our students at Garrett Huckle Bay. And uh, we'll just uh, go on, just get right into it. So Garrett, uh, tell me just a little bit about yourself. I'm 16. I'm a junior in high school. I'm in the band. I have two brothers and two sisters. I like being in the youth and adult choir and working in Awana and just being active in the church. Very good. Now, have you always been in the church? In third grade, when my family brought me. Okay. Well, did you accept Christ as a, a third grader? No. Okay. Well, tell me when you accepted Christ, so the circumstances, you know, where you were at, that kind of thing. Give me a little bit of background. It was the summer before ninth grade. I was in Alabama. I was at student life camp. The speaker was preaching, and God was getting a hold of me. I had a shaky feeling that I wasn't living right. And he said, to pray the prayer if you want to be saved. I know that doesn't save you, but... Right. And then, so I prayed it, I mean, yeah, I prayed it, and I got saved. Well, good. Now, was this your first time at student life camp? No, it's my second time. Your second time. So, so the first time you went, you know, had a good time. So you think this year that you were just, that year you are just going to go and have a good time again? Were you expecting to, to hear from God like you did? No. But since you became a Christian, um, were there any influences in your life at the church or outside the church that helped you in your walk? Brother Lowry, Brother Rod, my aunt and my grandma. Okay. Now, and how did they help you? What are some of the things they did? Brother Rod and Brother Lowry taught me how to live in Christ, read the Bible, and live my life right. My aunt and grandma, taught, they t tell me what I'm doing wrong, and my aunt brings me to church. Okay. Do you think it's very important for those people to do some of those things in your life? Yes, because yeah. we need people to support us. Well, very good. All right, now, do you think you have arrived then? No, I have a long way to go. Okay, yeah. how so? What are some things that you think you, that you need to continue to, to grow in? Reading the Bible, my attitude. Okay, well, Garrett, thank you very much for being with us today. You're welcome.